This is a video of my jeans. Or in fact, it's an update on my denim jacket. This is the Nudie Jeans Connie jacket, dry denim, and it's 8 years old. If you want to see how this jacket evolved since 6 months ago, you can find a video of that too. Just click on the link in the description. This video shows an update on the honeycombs on the arms and the folding lines on the end of the sleeves. Because the sleeves were a little bit too long, I folded the end in half, which gave it a tighter wrist and now some amazing fades. Look at those fades! And don't forget to look at the previous video on this jacket. The difference is very cool. Last year I ironed on way too many colored patches and because I regret that so much, I had to cover them up. I used an old pair of nudie jeans and hand stitched some patches over patches and I even made a pocket for my phone. You can also see the honeycombs from the old jeans here. Look at those fades. And this is my improvised sashiko patch. It was a practice but I really love the result. It's subtle and it matches the fades. On the back there's a whole lot of new stuff visible, compared to the last time I've shown you this jacket. There's only black, white and blue patchwork now, which gives it a more rock and roll kind of vibe. The boat on the back is something special. I met Michael London, who is tattooing jeans. Not by hand, but with a sewing machine. He literally sewed this on with a sewing machine. And I'm so happy with the result. The jacket is really becoming a piece of art. Make sure you follow Michael on Instagram, he's called Mike's Jeans. I wear this jacket a couple of times a week and every time I look in the mirror, I'm thinking, damn denim. <laughs>